What if plastic came from trees? Imagine that everyday items from keyboards to fleece jackets could be produced from a 100% renewable source right here in the Pacific Northwest. Advanced Hardwood Biofuels Northwest is developing bio-based chemicals, the building blocks of many everyday products, using the same biological and chemical processes that convert poplar trees into renewable biofuels. Along the conversion pathway from wood chips to renewable transportation fuels, intermediate chemicals are produced, including acetic acid, ethyl acetate, and ethylene, which can be used to make a variety of bioproducts that we use in our everyday lives. Acetic acid is produced early in the conversion process through the fermentation of poplar wood chips. It's in high demand globally for the manufacture of paints, adhesives, solvents, and textiles. Another useful chemical that can be produced in the conversion process is ethyl acetate, a less toxic and low odor solvent used in nail polish remover, cosmetics, perfumes, and to decaffeinate coffee and tea. Ethylene, another bio-based chemical intermediate, is a versatile chemical that is the backbone for many of the plastics we use every day, like water bottles and plastic bags. This diverse portfolio of high-value bioproducts is an important piece of a sustainable biofuel system based on renewable, locally produced, hybrid poplar trees. This is because the biochemicals are more valuable, can generally be produced at higher yields, and require fewer steps to manufacture. So, a biofuel system that includes bioproducts offers more immediate economic promise for the industry and for rural communities. In the long run, biofuels remain a key part of the solution for reducing greenhouse gas emissions and ensuring a domestic fuel supply. At the same time, establishing a supply chain and the technology for producing high-value bioproducts from renewable resources in the near term makes good sense economically and environmentally.